After all your efforts to put these training elements together, how will you know whether your program to boost morale after the downsizing is successful? To begin with, you'll need a benchmark of where current employee morale is. The easiest way to measure this is to take an employee satisfaction survey before any training begins. This can be as simple as a hard copy on which employees circle their answers, or as high tech as using one of the many free or low cost online survey applications. Regardless of what method you choose, it's important that it can be submitted anonymously if the employee chooses. The survey should provide the employee with a numerical scale and questions designed to gauge where along the scale they feel they are. For example, on a scale of 1 to 10, how happy are you in your job, instead of, are you happy in your job? The survey should include questions related to engagement, value, involvement, and other job satisfaction concepts. Have employees complete the survey at some interval during the six-month training program and again after the program is complete. In addition to a benchmark survey, there are other indicators that can provide clues about whether morale is improving, such as measuring the overall productivity of your workforce at regular intervals. Employees who are satisfied at work often perform better. With the downsizing, there may be a noticeable drop in your company's production numbers. If training is effective, production should begin to increase. The absentee rate for your employees is another gauge. Low morale translates into higher absenteeism. Low morale shows up in how often employees take extra time off or an increased frequency in the number of times they call in sick, even if they're not sick. Successfully improving morale should start to lower these numbers if they have begun to climb with the downsizing. Your employee turnover rate is another indicator of how satisfied your employees are in the workplace. Again, low morale oftentimes compels employees to move on to better paying jobs or a better work environment. Effective training may reduce the turnover rate, signifying that your company is doing the right things to keep morale high. You can also engage employees informally to monitor morale. A casual chat can provide insight into underlying issues as well as let employees know the company is open to hearing their problems. Throughout the entire training and downsize adjustment period, it's critical to regularly remind everyone that the company, you the trainer, and the remaining employees are in this together. The company's success is uncertain without everyone's help to improve morale. Finally, it's important that they understand every employee has it within their power to make a difference for themselves and their co-workers on a daily basis.